Dr. eventually administering the coup de gras in favor of Himachal Pradesh. Manipur, however, has right now returned to their attacking in death. And it's the opening goal of the day. The cross comes floating in from the right, keeping a keen eye on observation. Mm. Header from Moy Rangtem, Maling Nangba. And Manipur has got themselves ahead. And it's the captain once again. Here is reckoning class, the reason he is valued in such a high paradigm shift in their mindset in the breather during the breather they'll have some serious deliberations going on in the camp but we'll get back to that right now manipur is on the surge again this is a brilliant opportunity can they utilize it the first one was not used for the second time the goal was scored by manipur it initially felt that it should have been begged in the very first opportunity but he somehow missed his turn look at the cross look at the speed there's the cross this is how he couldn't really utilize it but eventually there was another player following his way through and finding the back of the net with an absolute thunder. first attempt wasn't a great one to intervene but the second time it was intervened successfully they keep on coming forward they keep on creating the opportunity across comes in and goal number three for manipur and himachal pradesh is coming apart at the seams mm. A brilliant team goal, if we may say it. A brilliant cross, an electric one from the left. Look at this one, two. There comes the cross from the goal scorer. And best team goals you'd ever come across. Yami Longwa coming forward with a wonderful flick that made it a one, two. Easy, it's going to be challenging of all sorts. But they'll have to come up with an answer. Oh, this can be a dangerous, dangerous move. Just as we were saying there, things have happened in the camp for Himachal But nonetheless, that has been punished by Himachal Pradesh. They kept on knocking on the doors and look at this chance. Fails to turn and fails to realize that there was a player breathing onto his neck. And eventually, it was Kisan Singh. Run again, but Manipur has snatched it, trying desperately to keep it under control and does it successfully. Sends a pass towards the centre, sends a forward pass. The opportunity for them, takes the shot and finds the back in the net. Manipur has restored their three goal cushion and it didn't take them. The man who scored the opener for Manipur on the day has also found his brace at Manipur's fort. And it was Virsha Tudu who got themselves ahead. However, coming back to this game, Manipur, another opportunity and another goal. Goal number five there. A scintillating cross coming all the way from the feet of their skipper. And an absolutely gem of a finish there. He's right now staring at a void that has been completely unfathomed by them. What a brilliant cross. An absolutely sizzling finish. Sends another cross from the front. A diving header and a second goal for Imagine Pradesh. Well, as I mentioned, that it is going to the right, but splashes it straight onto a Himachal Pradesh defender. And that's the final whistle of the game. Manipur walking away with an emphatic victory over. We have Malingamba with a brace. We have Yami Longba with a strike. Kishan Singh came with another. And Ronald Singh scored in the 74th minute. Sort of Kumar opened the scoring for Himachal Pradesh, exploiting a howler. And Hemant Kumar came in with a diving header to score the second for Himachal Pradesh. But that was not enough.